The San Jiao channel is a channel that I think is dreadfully underused. I'm not really certain why, maybe because it's not a quote unquote organ that people think about, but think about when your patient's pulses, your patient's centers aren't connected with each other. What would be a more perfect choice to use as a channel than Sanjiao points? Because that's what it's all about, is connecting the lower and middle and upper. Sanjiao one clears heat and wind, even from places far away, like up on the head, irritable eyes, red eyes, some sort of irritability, uh, redness and irritation of the eye. You would want to choose Sanjiao 1 because it takes away that heat and irritability. Sanjiao 2 also clears heat, wind, and stagnation. Interestingly enough, at least those first four, 1, 2, 3, and 4, all treat heat. So you have your choice for clearing heat. You might want to say to yourself, where is it I want to clear the heat? Okay, in the eyes, you can do Sanjiao 1, Sanjiao 2, Sanjiao 3. Uh, Sanjiao 3 also clears the channel. So especially if the heat or the stagnation is on the channel, maybe you want to choose Sanjiao 3 at that point. Sanjiao 3 benefits the eyes and the ears, so it can treat both of those issues, and it also can be used locally to treat hand and finger issues. Sanjiao 4 is the Yuan point. It clears heat and channel obstruction. It regulates the stomach. So for digestive issues, Sanjiao 4 is a good choice. Now, because it treats heat, you might want to especially think of it for heat issues. I think it's a great point for acid reflux because it is kind of a heat issue. Uh, also, it tonifies original qi and the ren and chong channels. So Sanjiao 4 is an interesting point to think about for menstrual issues and fertility challenges. When I needle Sanjiao 4, I point it this way in toward the thumb because the person's lying down like this, and I feel like angling it in toward the thumb points it in toward the center, which is where I want the energy of it to go. Sanjiao 5 releases the exterior and channel obstruction. Sanjiao 5 and Sanjiao 6 and 7 and 8, they all clear channel obstruction. So with the Sanjiao channel, think about it. You say to yourself, well, let's see, 1 through 8 already clears channel obstruction, but what is its purpose? Its purpose is to connect everything, to maintain the smooth flow of qi and blood. So of course it's gonna cheer. It's, of course most of its points are gonna clear channel obstruction. So Sanjiao 5 also releases the exterior. So at the beginning of the flu or a cold when the person has neck pain, Sanjiao 5 is a good point to start with. Sanjiao 6 also clears heat and wind and affects issues in the entire channel, but it also treats the hypochondriac area. Hypochondriac pain, also known as liver chi stagnation sometimes, and constipation, especially when it's caused by heat. Sanjiao 7, treat mostly issues on the head, ears and eye issues. Sanjiao 8, also mostly upper body issues, chest, ears, eyes. For Sanjiao channel combinations to treat hearing problems or deafness, including deafness, Sanjiao 5, 3, 17, 19, and small intestine 19. For rashes that are due to wind heat, liver 3, spleen 6, spleen 10, large intestine 11, and Sanjiao 5 to give the heat treatment an extra boost. Liver chi stagnation and or with chest depression, you can use liver 3 and 14, Sanjiao 6, and gallbladder 34. And with any chest depression, even though I don't have it printed on the list, I always use lung 1. Chest depression, you need to use lung 1 or lung 2 to open up the chest. And another good point to use to open up the chest is gallbladder 21. That's not one of its functions. Most of its functions, I don't think, say it has anything to do with the upper jaw, but you know what it will do? It'll take away this tension here that people have. So when people can't breathe, they tend to even get more tense because they don't know what to do. They can't relax their shoulders. So gallbladder 21 for chest depression and lung oppression. Oh, for weight loss. Oh my goodness, what everybody wants to do. 
Sanja 6, spleen 9, stomach 36, N40, and REN 12. Okay, those are points to use that assist weight loss along with the rest of your treatment, dealing with the person's basic core energy. And remember, with weight loss, it's 99% up to the patient. Mm -hmm.